co-main event, Cannon out of the blue, Hefner out of the red. I am so excited for this fight. <laughs> Here we go. This is, we are witnessing the future of our sport. Right now, right here. It's amazing. How lucky are we, Dave? Best seat in the house, Pearl. <laughs> Best seat in the house. <laughs> I love the lateral movement. I love the lateral movement that is coming out of. <clears throat> Both fighters. Extremely composed. Hefner in the red. Cannon out of the blue. Ooh, beautiful inside leg kick there He's by Matt. He's doing such a fantastic. Watch his lateral movement. He's looking and setting up these small shots. That's what his, his corner is calling for is they keep saying put him out and they're looking for him to land this right hand. And it's probably because the lead hand is so low sure. of cannons. Cannon's lead hand is just, it sits at, at, like at his midsection, which when you got small gloves on like this, it's, it's, just, it's such a dangerous. Such an opening, such a huge opening. Another overhand right there by Matt. It, there it is. Oh, beautiful job. This is what I talk about, composure and skill. He's not getting tight here. He's not trying to control this man. He is keeping his distance and range to just onslaught, to just land a barrage of shots and, and rain an onslaught on Cannon. He's got to get his leg out of there, but he thinks he can maybe end the fight in this position. He, oh, I took, nice sweep there. Let's see if he goes for a straight ankle here. Nice job, just taking those legs and turning them off to the side. But he does need to address this and get his leg out of here. There we go. Matt Hefner sits on top heavy. Look at that, and posting. I talked about this earlier. Instead of grabbing the head, you post on the head. And that he's, God, this kid's so technical and so advanced for his age. Wow. Ooh, looking for an arm. Nice far side control here. I don't know if he's gonna look for a Kimura or a submission or if he's just gonna utilize it to to um, keep on striking, keep on ground and pounding. To trans or excuse me, what's I can't even think of the word to keep moving into his transition, continue transitioning into a better position. Great. Matt Hefner's got so many weapons. His Looking at a little Bryce Mitchell Jr. Yes. I don't know. This, this kid's so technical and talented. It's a much different. This is a much different breed here. That right hand. He's he has found a home for his right hand tonight. Yeah. Just Cannon can never feel comfortable. Oh. Never is in the right spot. Man, massive strikes by Hefner. He's looking for a knockout. He's looking for that right hand knockout. Switch his stances. I was just gonna say, like, switching stances. Yeah, he keeps on catching that. Kicking, and countering and with the right hand. Now he's stalking, and he, but see how he's not rushing? He knows he has him hurt. He knows he found a home for his right hand, and he's not, he's not at all creating any, there's no urgency out of him. He's so composed. Beautiful flying knee into a strike. Corner's calling for him to finish him. Cannon struggling here. This could be the beginning of the oh. end. There it is. It is over. Matt wow. Hefner. Impressive. Impressive. Incredible performance here. And respect. He's this kid's so, such a bright talent, such a bright talent. So excited for him and to watch his career unfold.
gentlemen, our referee, Frank Pierre, steps in to call the help to the bout at one minute and 10 seconds of round number two. Declare your winner by TKO from the red corner, Matt Hefner. Uh, congratulations. Um, you're just 17, but how do you get like the discipline to fight? You're doing great. Great question. She was saying you're 17, so young. How are you such a great fighter, so uh, being so young? Yeah, you know, um, started doing this when I was nine years old. Went through a lot of competitions, and uh, that enables the discipline and enables the um, composure you have just to get in there and do what I do, you know, and just doing that helped me grow up. Unbelievable. I was just asking the matchmaker who's the youngest island fight champion of all time. Would that want to be you one day? Would you want to fight for a title soon under the Island Fights banner? You know, hey, yeah, soon. Um, we realize that, hey, it's going to come soon enough. Um, so, yeah, sooner or later, I'm going to start taking belts. It might be my next one. Who knows? We'll see. There we go, guys. Pensacola, give it up. 17 years young, Matt Hefner. I got one more thing to say. I want to go ahead and thank all my coaches. They're great at Alice Martial Arts at Crestview, Florida. I want to thank all you guys for coming out and having a great night here watching these fights. Go have some fun and uh, enjoy the last fight. Yeah, thank you all. Congratulations. And I want to go ahead and say, if you want to support me in my journey, go ahead and like and uh, follow me on Facebook and Instagram, Hefner MMA, that is with two Fs, Hefner MMA. I'm not as, uh, I'm not as popular as the one F guy, Hugh Hefner. Anyway, thank you guys for coming out. Congratulations, Matt Hefner.